Hi, uh, your first name is? Donato. And you are? Antonio. And are you the Mad Mexican uh, sure. guys? Okay, listen. I finally got time to do an interview because you guys are busy here at the uh, night market at 99 February. So before the crowd comes, uh, I need to know more about what you're doing here. Can you walk me through some of your uh, signature uh, dishes here? Of course. So we basically we make and distribute our fresh Mexican salsa here in Toronto. We have been doing this for eight years in Toronto. So we have that one which is the pico de that one is the pico the pico de gallo spicy. We have two versions. That one is the spicy one. The spicy one. And what's in it that makes it there so is unique? A, there is a tomato. There is a onion. There is a chili oil. There is a pepper. Mm -hmm. So jalapeno. Great. Okay. Um, For that particular flavor profile. Next, you got next the next one. We have that that one, which is, is the, the guacamole. We ripen our own avocados here. Yeah. This is basically it's 90 90 percent of this salsa is a uh, avocado. It's very fresh avocado. We ripen until the exact moment the avocado to be ready for the to make the salsa. That one is the spicy version, which is has a pepper. Actually, I had it. it's very subtle in the spice because I don't like spicy stuff. But it's very very subtle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. very subtle. Because I subtle. think if you made it too much, it would be overpowering. No, 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 right? We don't try to kill anyone. We let people enjoy the salsa. That's our you know that's our goal. So that no, then you know, no. Spicy that you say uh, I can eat. So, okay, great. Uh, next, so also the next one we have here the salsa verde, which is basically you know this salsa is a good combination with white fish. You know that salsa, 90% of that salsa is uh, green tomato, tomatillos. Yeah. Right? That's uh, also have onion. Okay. That's a good combination. It's a medium taste. It's not too spicy. Oh, this one. That one. And that one is one of our best seller. And um, this is uh, there is a lot of work in it. That one is uh, uh, basically is 80 percent of that salsa is red, roasted tomato, has onion, but the flavor I would say the, the real flavor is very uncommon, very unusual flavor. It's coming from a dry pepper which is called morita. Yeah, I noticed. I noticed a different taste, and that'd be good for different types of meat. Different, yeah, that's good for meat. That's the perfect combination with meat. Great. But we okay. call that one salsa morita. Yeah. Okay. Great. Also okay. here, we have here one of our best seller. That one is by far. This is called salsa mori uh, pico de gallo mild. Yeah. This is basically the same that the the other one, but it doesn't have a pepper. Okay. That's one of our best seller. Why is it one of your best sellers? Why? Why? Because we sell a lot. We sell like a hot case. Too many. So many. Why? It's just a nice mild. Flavor. You know flavor? what? I'm gonna tell you one thing. So once you start to eat these two guys, the guacamole mild and the pico de gallo mild, you don't know how to stop. It. So. I might put you to the test. Okay. It's gonna after the interview. It's gonna, trust me. It's gonna damage your pocket, but at the same time, you're gonna be very happy. Okay. Good. The That's next a, one. This is my favorite. It's a With roasted. Roasted tomatillo and avocado. Roasted. Okay. Yeah. Tomatillo avocado. That's again. That's why? Why favorite. is that your favorite? That's my favorite because you can find a, this one you can find a very like unusual and common flavor and at the same time you can feel a little bit spicy the pepper but it's not too much so you can eat as many times as you want that you you want to feel like a, you want to eat more this is amazing the salsa also with meat with chips or even whatever yeah. that's amazing okay so it's a little bit less in a scale from one to ten six also we have here that one is the chunky guacamole mild okay okay that one is is by far 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 our best seller okay it's fresh you know, Why, it's just, just a good chunky yeah, it's a good avocado. We, ri we ripen our own avocado we the, the, until the exactly moment to be peeled and now you can see it's very fresh you know uh, it's so fresh we make every single day because the way we work we get the order from our retailer and next day we make the salsa so okay great and next, next one the last one this is the black bean okay, okay. that one Okay. Some mild taste. This is a we call that one two way because we put two different kinds of pepper, which is one is mild, one is fresh pepper, another is a dry pepper. Also, there is lime juice in it. That's amazing and perfect combination with burrito, quesadilla, omelette. That's a good combination. Very nice. I'm gonna ask you, what's your favorite? For me, my favorite is the 
salsa morita, this one over here. Yeah. And why is that? Why? Because it's quite spicy and it's made out of a dry pepper called morita from Mexico. You can find it anywhere else, only in this sauce. So that's why I like it. And it's very good. It goes very well with the meat. Okay. And I'm a very meat fan, so I like it a lot. Okay, great. So our website, guys, is uh, w dot. Mexican dog.